This is the HTP Invertig 251 AC-DC. In this video, I'll give an overview of the features and capabilities that this machine has. This is the first video in a video owner's manual series, and in the following videos, I'll go through how to actually set up the machine and use all of these features and capabilities. The machine includes a foot pedal and torch, a work clamp and regulator, so you can get welding right away. There is 250 amps of output on AC and DC for TIG welding and 200 amps of output for stick welding, which also has AC, DC, and poles. The LCD screen is large and easy to read and it has an intuitive menu system so you can navigate directly through all of your settings and get set up without having to access a lot of hidden menus. Some parameters can be changed from the front panel on the fly and it includes some unique features right here. This is dynamic power, which will actually reduce the amperage based on a longer arc length. So as I increase the arc length here, you can see that amperage reduced, and that gives some added stability and some level of control without using a foot pedal for situations where that's necessary. There's a mixed mode AC-DC, which will give some cleaning from an AC cycle alternated with the penetration of a DC arc to weld on thicker aluminum with less amperage. Here you can fully adjust the AC waveform and this includes independent amplitude adjustment and also independent waveforms on the electrode positive and negative side of the cycle. A fast tack mode allows you to make small repeatable tacks and it uses a unique pulse that's engineered to bring the material together. And you can make repeated tacks along the edge of a joint. It's great for thin material and thick material alike. And this is the result from that. You also have a soft pulse feature which reduces the harshness of the noise from the pulse welding and gives a slightly softer arc when you're welding. There's also double pulse which combines a high frequency pulse to give you a nice focused arc and reduced heat input with a low frequency pulse which can help pace progression and give a rippled appearance. You can see the outcome of double pulse here on this stainless steel weld. It can also stick weld, and with stick welding you have features like AC with full waveform adjustability, and you also have pulsed stick that can help control your heat input. The machine is available as a dual voltage version also. The remote interface is compatible with 14-pin Miller accessories, so you can use it with a variety of other equipment that is compatible with that. You can see that this machine has a lot to offer, and in the following videos in the series, I'll go through how to actually set up the machine and how to use basic and advanced TIG features, as well as how to stick weld with the machine.